Unpause. Whoa! That glitchy unpause there. Oh my goodness. That was some... That was some glitchy Bowser laughing. Let me tell you the story of how it all begins. Let me show you the pieces where they all fit in. Let me show you the people still stuck here for... Are you... I have no idea what that's from. Is that... Is that maybe like a Scream reference from like Ghostface or something with them being added into DBD? Is that what that is, Hot? Because I'm not sure. <laughs> I would... If I had to guess, I would say that is what with, you know, him being a new killer coming to DBD. He'll be in the public test build in a few days. Don't forget to... Wait, my HP and BP isn't restored? Hold on just a second here. Also, how's it going today, Hot? How go things? Yeah, maybe I should restore some stuff here. Anyway, I hope to... I hope to beat this game. This stream. I hope to finally beat Bowser Inside Story here. No, actually, you wish it was? <laughs> okay, what is that a reference to then? I hope to beat the game this stream, but... We shall see what we can do here. So, last time... Last time, the Dark Star was finally, like, freed. It went into Bowser's body, like, Fawful took some of the Dark Star's power, so now Fawful's pretty powerful. And then with the power that the Dark Star had left, it went into Bowser and started copying Bowser's DNA to get all of his abilities. So now, the Dark Star is basically like a Dark Bowser, and the Dark Star's looking for Fawful to regain his power. Fawful's looking for the Dark Star to steal the rest of his power. So Fawful and the Dark Star are kind of like enemies now, trying to take back each other's power that they have left and stuff like that. There's the Dark Bowser. I already forget what voice I was doing for him. But yeah, that makes for a great Halloween animatronic face. And some song on YouTube you found today. Huh. You can find some pretty cool songs on YouTube sometimes. And yes! Also there. I was hoping it wouldn't take this long since like the last time. Well, the last time I streamed it wasn't too long ago. It was just like later after the 24-hour charity stream, which you can still see like the goal of thing down there where the goal was absolutely shattered to pieces. But, but like the time before that when we were, oh dang it, there was a healing thing right here the whole time where I could have healed for free. The game told me don't forget to restore your HP and BP. Dang it, man. But yeah, hopefully this should be the final time here. But yeah, your little bro likes this. YouTuber or fandroid, a robotic musician, sounds whack, but he's actually pretty damn good. Bro's good taste? Huh, never heard of that. That sounds like something that'd be weird. That sounds like something that'd be like a joke. Uh, I can just break the, the Fawful statues here. What the? I was about to say, can I not go through here? What's this? Oh. I can do this, right? And then I can do... No! Bam! Special Fangs X. What the heck is this? What the heck do I do with a Special Fangs X? Increase the wearer's BP a good amount. That's not bad. Increase his power a good amount. Yeah, I'll take the Special Fangs X then, as well I'll do over the power increase. Sounds good to me. Boop. Miracle Cheese. Miracle Cheese! They see me rolling. No. Uh... Siri, can I didn't say anything to you. I was making a freaking see me rolling freaking dumb reference and then Siri activated. Jeez, how much can I explore before having to go to the place where the game wants me to go? What the heck? Oh, this is the room from the beginning of the game where they were having, like, the council meeting about, like, what to do about the blorbs, and now it's all, like, fawfalized and dark and stuff like that. Even though he fawfalized it and darked it, he's darkened it, he didn't, like, clean up the burn marks from Bowser or, like, the table or anything like that. But yeah, not much happened for you today besides you demonstrating how to do attack cancel for beatdown, then getting two clips on him in the same game, invoking the attack cancel. Jeebus. The apprentices outclass the master. That's like what I said in my head once you started, like, getting better than me in Smash 4. <laughs> you know. Now he's gonna try to learn attack cancels. They sound tricky. It sounds like something I'd try to learn if I actually played a bunch of the new Smash. But I'm like too into. I'm too into other things now, like this game and Xenoblade Chronicles 1 2 Torna. We got. Oh my goodness, that lag. We got things to do. We got other things to stream nowadays. Too many things that I want to get through. But yeah, that sounds like a fun time. Yeah, exactly, Alyssa Zero. Why doesn't he fix the table? What the heck? He literally fawfalized the whole castle, but he doesn't fix the table? 
Also, look at this freaking stained glass here. The, like, peach fawful there. <laughs> Lead into 80% true combos for Falcon. Jeebus. That is absurd. Whoa, what do we have here? Dark Star. Wait, what was I doing for Waffle's voice? Dark Star. Dark Star. Waffle is wanting you. Oh, Waffle's all weird looking now. Seriously, you again. You're such a huge pain. It is you who are the pain to me. I am needing more power. Like, that's my problem. I'm done with you, pal. Or is that fake me? Your meddling has made Fawful have a fury large as the world. Bowser, it is time for meeting and greeting with your doom. For now, it is the end of the final act of the finale's closing last encore. I am having this castle, and now I am thinking. It needs Fawfulization. Time for remodeling. Super Peach's Castle of Fury. Wait, didn't he already remodel it, though? Wait, what? What the heck is going on now? I don't... Clear, quite remember this? Is this another giant battle? Is that what's going on here? Oh yeah, it's starting to feel familiar now. Oh then. Oh then. Well, um, it's so weird seeing this in like the 3DS 3D. And also in HD because my computer. Oh my goodness. I'm starting to remember this now, bit by bit. Well then. <laughs> Poor Bowser, man. Poor, poor dude. But yeah, huh, that sounds very scary there. My goodness. And I forgot about this part here. Don't I like have to change my controls for this thing? Look upon this emo globin, for it is one with savish abilities. Is that not globin? But I'm a rare, so often a savish emo globin. Do I not globin? Oh, traveler, save your globin. Don't. For this mini game, I have to literally like change my controls to like WSD being like the next thing over. I think I do, right? <laughs> low key, that's terrifying. Low key. Yeah, it's a bit, and it's Peach's castle. Hold on. If I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure I need to literally change around controls for wait. For this, um, uh, left. Fine, I'll just. Sw yeah, I know it's already bound. Can I just? Maybe it's fine. Maybe if I use the D pad, I don't remember. <laughs> you don't globe it. Yeah, exactly. We carry with us a message of crisis for Bowser's life energy. We have awaited you in this sacred place, ever patient. First, you must hit the emo globe into the right to save. Then, it falls to you to revive Bowser's flagging life energy. Board the boat to revival and ford the adrenaline channel. Yes, board the boat to revival. I already saved. I'm pretty sure I can't do this mini game unless I swap around my controls if I remember correctly. Because, like, circle pad here does nothing. I can only go to the left. D pad? Yeah, I need to change my controls around. I mean, what if I pause it here? I don't know why it does this. Um, so I need to set like circle pad to something else then. So, um, but that also means I have to change the directional pad to like other things. So like random buttons, I'll change this back later. I'll fix it later. And then circle pad, I can set it to these things. And then bada bing, bada boom, let's continue. And then all of a sudden it works for whatever reason. Oh. Well, that sucks, doesn't it? There goes two of my hearts. Two of my three hearts. Well, there goes all three of them because I couldn't go into the corner there. Anyway, yeah, I have to change my controls around for this, and I have no idea why. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to remember to change them back after this. Back to what they usually are, back to what I'm used to. Anyway, I think that's the first time I've actually failed that mini game without my controls being, like, screwed over. Like, they were at first, and I had to get back into the swing of things, but still. Still, you know, man. Big oof indeed. Ah! Ah! Loopity bop! Whoa! Meh! Ah! Ah! Meh! 
Literally the only way to take damage is if you mess up a lot of these things though is the thing. And that's I guess you just run into them as they're coming down at like normal speed or something. Ah, no, I'm not risking it anymore. Dang it. No, I'm not taking these risks. Right, reminds you of Galaga, I know, right? <laughs> Or like space invaders or something like that. Anything along the What do you mean? Oh, it was reversed. I was so confused for a second there. Well, let's be careful not to lose that last that last heart there. Ah. Jeez, I need to do a lot of these this time, don't I? Ah. A whole bunch of them. This one should do it. No. Meh. Ah, it's so scowy. There we go, yes. I swear, if this thing damages me once. And yeah, I have seen Pixels. Such a, such a, uh, movie, I don't even know. This energy sparked. I haven't actually seen Into the Spider-Verse. I've heard good things about it, so I've been meaning to, like, check it out one day. But I actually haven't seen it. I have not. But I heard very good things about that. Oh, that move A. I swear, if you hit me with one of these things. There we go. Yes. This energy spiked. I was just moving again. Hold your system vertically. Man, it's such a good thing that I have like a scene set up for this, you know? Well, here we go, I guess. This lag, though. It's still cool seeing these seeds in 3D. You know. <laughs> I crushed this <him> again! <laughs> <laughs> yes, toss Peach's castle. Now, how the heck does that happen to Peach's castle? Yes, do the thing that Mario does to you in Mario 64! Roar reversal, except now Bowser's doing it to Peach's castle. <laughs> I love it. Mario 64 things. Oh my goodness, this castle got some upgrades from the DS version, didn't it? My oh my. It's so weird on like an actual 3DS holding the system sideways for these boss battles. So wonky, man. Well, I guess it's time for the final giant battle. The final giant battle of the game. And of course, it's giant Bowser against Peach's castle itself, but it's all fossilized. Well then, I like, look at the smoke that they added in this version for the 3S version. It's all eerie and stuff. All right. The heck is this? What's your deal? Oh, how's it going, bearded? Huh, fireworks, real festive. <laughs> how's it going today, bearded? Oh, oh, I remember this now. He puts like black holes on both sides. Huh, nothing. Worst fireworks ever. So you have to like knock your opponent into like the black hole is the idea of this battle. Weird fireworks, pal. Real weird. Well, moving on. <laughs> Things are fine. Time to deal with your ugly mug. <laughs> Hot. Yeah, that's gonna be pulling me in. No, that thing's sucking me in. Don't even try it. Do I have to like, numerous slides, numerous slides. Come on, I can only do numerous slides so much. Oh my goodness, I think I just opened the calculator on my PC. Cause I like tapped that. Okay, things are a-okay. But yeah, you read that as actual name, we read it was confused, looked at it again, then actually processed what was typed of accountant harmonica. Yeah, exactly, man. Alright, we're gonna do punch here. Falcon! Punch! Wow, oh, that sure didn't do a whole lot of damage, did it? Not a whole lot there, huh? What the heck is this? What the heck are these things? 
freaking Fawful bots? Do I have to like burn them now? Oh my goodness, this lag. There's so many Fawful bots, it's literally lagging the game. Boop. Get out of here, Fawful bots, with your freaking laggy shenanigans. Heat, heat, fire, fire, flammable ballast eject. Eject all heated cargo. Oh, cool, man. Oh, is he gonna run at me? Yeah, Bowser is exactly a falcon mate. Dang it! I was trying to swipe it, but it's hard when my screens aren't separated at all, you know? Whoops, wrong, wrong layout here, sideways one. Um, but yeah, I <laughs> thought that up for an entire two seconds, that name there. Encroyable. Boop. Alrighty, let's hopefully not get hit by one of his dumb attacks again. Are you gonna do the thing that lags the game again? What the heck is this? Oh, and it is lagging the game though. Ah! Oh my goodness, this is completely messing with the game's speed, isn't it? Punch attack. Falcoon! Punch! Ah, right, right at the edge there. Alrighty, you're gonna do the second black hole now? Oh, what the heck is this? Enemy still active. Launch unavoidable attack at once. Unavoidable? Resistance useless. Consume this. What do you mean unavoidable? Oh, dang, man. Oh, straight into the freaking black hole thing. Slide. Yes. I mean, if it was a real black hole, the whole planet would be destroyed already, but you know. I'm gonna just call it a black hole anyway. Last attack successful. Black hole plus body blow combo. Oh, that again. Come on. Knock it away. Knock it away, Bowser. Please, blast that thing down with a fireball. Do I have to like aim at it now? Or no, he just automatically does it. There we go. There we go. There it is at the other side now. See that? Oh, Bowser, baby. Uh-oh. What now? But there's a black hole on both sides now. On both sides now. Safety protocol. System online. Oh, he has shields now. Frontal defense systems. Fully operational. But that's just frontal. You watched last year's Smash 64 combo cons. Now every time you see Bowser whine of that punch, the Smash 64 voice line plays in your head. <laughs> nice. Alright, Falcoon! Punch! Get over there! Dang it, it wasn't enough? That sucks. That's unfortunate, isn't it? Aha! 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 Not do there! Not do there! Just punch bullets, easy. Easy peasy. Yeah, he's putting his shields back on again. Like a loser. Get into that black hole, loser. Boop. Excellent. Yes, get in there. There we go. Safety protocol, air, full defense shutdown. Oh. Aw, oh, dang it. I have no screen separation. It's so hard to tell where he is. Oh man, Bowser for Mortal Kombat, yes please. Uh-oh, 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 slide, slide, Sl numerous slides, numerous slides, come on, numerous slides. Oh, I was doing numerous slides, what do you mean? Oh, maybe it was better that I didn't do numerous slides in that case, huh. So I was able to do that. Well then, what the heck is this? Oh, it's this again. It's this thing again. No, get the little one. There we go. You stay away from me. You stay away this instant. Should I use the mushroom? Let's use the mushroom. Yeah, just pull it out of like your shell and then munch a munch it down the hatch, sure. May as well. There we go, look at that. We got a little bit of health back. Uh-oh. Spinning slide! Come on, spinning slide! 
Spin, 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 spin. It's so hard with a mouse. Come on. Oh, it's hard to even see my cursor. Push him over there. There we go. Dang it. It's so hard with no screen separation. Yeah, most of the giant bosses are kind of slow paced bosses. Aw, oh, dang it, man. Should I just go into that black hole on purpose so that I can do the thing? Because I didn't, I don't even think I took any damage when I was in it before. Like, what if I just don't do numerous slides and let him go into it like this? And then I do that. Look, I didn't take any damage, but I can do a little bit of damage to him. What's the point of doing numerous slides to stay out of it? What the heck? What even logic? What even? Okay, next time I put him in the black hole there, I'm gonna have to like wait a second extra than I already am. Boop. This is what I'm gonna have to do. Like, is he gonna go into it now? No, not yet. Oh. Huh. Ah. Man. Spooky scary. Oh. He's putting his shields back up. All right, punch him into the, punch him into the black hole. Punch a peach's castle straight into the black hole. Come on, there we go, get in there. All right, look at this. Look how I have to time it for me, look at this. Dang it, dang it man, it's so hard with, when I have no separation. It's gonna be like Octo's final boss, which took two days and a half to beat. <laughs> I, probably not. But, but I'm pretty sure Octopath Traveler's final boss took even longer than that to beat. Because, like, I tried it the first time, and then I was grinding to beat it for, like, over a week at least. And then, um, and then there was a second attempt and failed that, too. And then there was, like, a little bit more grinding and a little bit more preparation, I think. Just a little bit. Because I was already mostly prepared. And then had to do, like, the eight boss boss rush in that game again. Oh man, that I think that took I think that final boss took like a couple of weeks. Honestly. That's just the boss itself on the stream. What, this one here? Something that seems like it's gonna take a couple of weeks to be as long as I don't mess up the timing when he freaking pops out of the Oh not counting grinding. Yeah, just in like raw time attempting it on the stream, including like the boss rushes. <laughs> May as well have been like two and a half days. Basically. Wait, get, get him. No, get him! Oh, come on, man. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it this attempt. I keep mistiming it when it comes out of the black hole because I have no screen separation. It's so hard to tell. Like, like, what do I do? Like, look at this, this is my point of view. Ah, take that! Finally, jeez. But I have to like not get hit anymore. I think like two more hits and I'm dead. Enemy's still active. Query, can it survive this? I don't think this was supposed to be Fawful's voice. I think that was supposed to be like the robotic castle voice this whole time, but whatever. Oh, the black holes are gonna come closer now. They're both gonna get like closer and make the ring smaller. So like one hit from either side bumps you into the black hole. I'm fairly certain now. I'll just keep doing a false voice, I guess. Oh, never mind. Activate black hole endgame! Hmm. Maybe I should do a more robotic voice for like, because I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be like the robotic pe fossilized Peach's Castle talking. Bet you never thought you'd see Peach's Castle in this kind of a form. All right, time for the endgame. All right, just to time this. Boost system online. Invisibility field now oper- Oh, dang it. Now operational. Enemy evasive maneuvers. Null. Oh, dang it. Dang it, man! It's hard enough without screen separation. It's already hard enough as is. Smashville's blast zones? Yeah, basically. What's the point of even, like, sliding here? I guess I- Oh. Am I stuck in it? Oh! Well then, um, I can't get hit one more time, or else I die. 
One more hit and I'm dead, so I mean. I guess this boss might take two tries. Maybe. Stop it, man. So rude. Stop doing that. No, I was sliding. What do you mean? Wing IDE? No. Yeah, I guess we have to try it again. Dang it, man. Man, oh man. Well. And we're back to the beginning of the battle and the beginning of the music. Dang, man. We've already seen this before, but whatever. Deal. Second tries the charm. Ugh, fireworks. Real festive. Yeah, yeah. I know. The black hole. Uh, nothing. Worst fireworks ever. Dangerous fireworks. Your fireworks, pal. Real weird. Well, moving on. Uh, nose. Time to deal with your ugly mug. Yeah. How about I just don't slide swiftly? No, oh, that thing's sucking me in. Don't even try it. What if I just don't slide swiftly? Because as long as I slide out immediately when I get into it, it doesn't seem like I take any damage anyway. So what's even the point of trying to... Look at that, I didn't take any damage. But he takes damage because I went into it. So, you know, never in a million years would you have thought you'll bet money that Peach's castle will be possessed and turned robotic by a poor English, poor metaphorical speaker green thing that wants death and distraction, destruction for everyone and everything. Exactly, man. And there's giant Bowser fighting it. <laughs> Fighting Peach's castle. You know, this is just a normal Saturday. Last attack, successful. Black hole plus body blow combo. What do you mean last attack was successful? I took no damage, but you took a little chip of damage. Like, it literally benefits me to go into the black hole. That's kind of dumb. That's kind of silly. Also, did I just get a good there? Instead of an excellent, because oops. I wasn't paying enough attention. Get out of here, freaking dudes that lag the game. Bringing it down to 75% speed. Boop. Peach's robotic castle, world of light boss. It'd be way too big though. Eat, eat, fire, fire. Flammable ballast, eject. Eject all heated cargo. So I guess we get one mushroom in this fight there. It would be really cool, but like, how would this work though? Something that would be even cooler would be like, Fawful and Smash Bros. Dang it, man. I can't time it. I don't have screen separation like there is on the on the stream there. It's so hard to tell. I just want Fawful and Smash Bros. Boop. There's not enough villains in Smash Bros. I want more of them. How's it going today, Ketson? Oh, I just got a copyright claim. What, is that for my Guitar Hero part of my 24-hour stream that I just uploaded today? Is that why YouTube's sending me an email saying copyright claim on one of my videos? That's probably it. Yeah, I know, right? He could just be a Bowser Jr. Echo. Why not? Just, just make him a Bowser Jr. Echo and put Fawful in. I would love to play as Fawful. But yeah, you're drinking Kappa. Does that mean you're not actually drinking or you are drinking? My oh my. Oh, that again, come on. Yeah, I, re I would love to see Fawful and Smash so much. Okay, you are drinking then. Please, I'll blast that thing down with a fireball. Like, I would love it so much if they put Fawful and Smash Bros. Back in the original Smash Ballot for Smash 4, I voted for Fawful. Like, Smash Bros. needs more villains. Fawful, please. <laughs> see that? Oh, Bowser, baby. And I was gonna, like, put his shields up or whatever. Safety protocol, system online. A whale then. Frontal defense systems, fully operational. You hit trying to stream 3DS games that use both screens as one big screen? What, like this? Well, typically I just have like the separation between, the, oh, I guess it's not like the real separation where it shows like the one and the other. But in this case, I have it like as the kind of real separation where it works the way that it would normally work. But yeah, it can definitely be tricky sometimes. Boop. Excellent. 
Yeah, it can be difficult where to like put stuff on the screen for like 3DS stuff. Still on Sora, Black Shadow, Ashley, Shovel Knight, and Master Chief. Then there's a few others, but those main ones. There's a lot of characters there. I just want. Actually, I was about to say I just want like Fawful and Waluigi, but oh come on, man. But I changed my mind. I want a Xenoblade Chronicles 2 character as well. Like Nia or something, that'd be cool. But if they did put in a character, which they're probably not going to at this point, it'd probably just be like Rex or something as the main character. Boop. But imagine if they put like Nia from Xenoblade Chronicles 2 in instead. That'd be so hype. Safety protocol, air, full defense, shut down. Look at this. Look at my point of view. Ah! I actually got him there. Jeez, that's so hard to time without screen separation. My oh my. Yeah, it'd be really cool if it was Pyra as well. Like, anyone but Rex, basically. Like, I like Rex, but there's so many other characters that I'd want in Smash if they put in a character otherwise. Like, most preferably, I would choose the Nia. It'd be like a very unique weapon, what with like the dual, um, like ring blade things that she has. Or like a sword that she can optionally get later that I'm not gonna like speak too much about because like spoilers but later in the game she also has the option to wield a pretty cool looking sword so either one of those would be cool or just like Pyro with the with the Aegis sword or something like that maybe an ability where maybe an ability imagine if they put in Pyra and they made her just like um what's his name joker is in smash bros where like a bar charges up but once it gets fully charged up she changes to mithra and becomes more powerful that'd actually be so cool spinning slide spinning slide come on like imagine if it was like joker where it's like you have a counter that like charges it up more stuff like that and it also charges up over time and with damage and stuff like that and then eventually you can swap to mithra and you're more powerful as mithra wouldn't that be cool a friend was telling you a leaker who leaks Simon Ridley and Joker claims that the next DLC will indeed be shown at E3 and will be Banjo and Kazooie. That'd be interesting. I also seem pretty iffy what with like Microsoft owning like the Banjo Kazooie title now, right? I'm pretty sure that that's that they own that. But yeah, do you remember that leaker and his claims so possibly true? Interesting. Like there's definitely gonna be Smash news at E3. There's no way there won't be. So I very. So, I'm very confident that we'll find out the next DLC character then, but who will it be? Alright, this time's the time. I could have Nintendo's been smooshing booty lately. Though maybe it would work out, if that's meant as like a positive thing. However, those words translate to in like regular speak. I'm pretty sure that translates to positive. Oop. But it could also mean negative, I'm not sure. Boopity bop. Get in there. Boo system online. Invisibility field now operational. Enemy evasive maneuvers null. Hmm. Ah! I did it that time. I did it that time. So it would be interesting. I've never played a Kingdom Hearts game, but in Smash it would certainly be interesting. No! No! No, 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 oh my goodness. Oh, so birthdays in four days? Nice, that's like, that's basically when the public test build for DVD is out, so people will be able to try out Ghostface in that game for like the first time. It'll be like a day after. A bunch ton of Funko Pops, hopefully. I'm not actually sure what those are, but I imagine like a figurine of some sort. But yeah, it's pretty hype. Do you have any, like, special plans going on on that day? Any, like, events that you're doing? Because I know for me, the last birthday that I had, I basically spent it streaming. And I streamed, like, one of my childhood games, Sly Cooper. Boop. And we beat that game in one sitting. That was a fun time, honestly. Enemy strength is admirable, but you are finished. It'd be really cool if Sly Cooper was in Smash as well. And Paper Mario would be interesting. Just want some more d decor and collectibles in your room. That's like the coolest stuff ever. Just having a room full of like. So, this is a perfect example right here. All the freaking posters and stuff like that. This is literally a perfect example of like cool rooms when they're decked out. Oh, oh, what is this now? Oh. Oh, I have to do that when he's not doing this thing. 
Ah! Boop. Alright, slide again. Boop. Is this black hole slowly damaging me? I can't actually tell. Oh yeah, it is. Come on, get him. But it's not slowly damaging him. That task falls to me, I got- What? That did like no damage to him? Oh, like, do I have to do like the finisher now? Get with the family, then hang out with all your friends at your house, most likely just smash the whole time. Nice. Smash is always fun. Clips <laughs> for days. Of course. Oh, the black holes are going away. I guess it's time for the finisher, where I'm gonna get a good instead of an excellent, because like, I suck at this. There we go, finishing move. Use this move to end the fight. And most of your friends are decent at Smash World, clips for them as well then. What are we gonna do to finish off Peach's castle? Tap quickly! It's so hard on a mouse, and it like, yeah, it just says, okay. I can't get an excellent on that. I can't, man. Falcoon! Oh, it's more like a Donkey Kong punch. <laughs> okay, Falcoon punch! <sighs> Take that, Peach's Castle. There we go. That's how you do it. Easy peasy, man. Whoa, what's this? Oh, whoa, what's this? I don't remember this. Ah, you can't even do it. Peach's castle has been thwarted. There we go. Oh my goodness, the whole thing's exploding. Those are going to be some expensive repairs to the castle. My goodness. God, that's what you get for stomping on me when I was little. So that's the final giant battle of the game then. Hey! Get the camera back on. Victory! We got presents, man. Intruder fangs? What the heck is that? And flex bean. Just what I always wanted, a flex bean. Man, oh man. Well, that was certainly interesting, wasn't it? Certainly an interesting time, huh? Oh my goodness, the lag as well. My, oh my. Well... Very interesting and unique boss battle, huh? Okay, so that was not a fight I ever expected. Where? Dark power. Being who drains. Where? Where? You! Give me back, Peach! Wait, I mean it! You let Peach go! Wait, I mean... I mean it, not I mean it. Dang it. I didn't... I'm dumb. Hey, what's going on up there, huh? Is Peach in trouble? Jippy, listen! This crazy dark smoke dude that- Wait, that looks just like me came out of my mouth! Wait, what? Yeah, and this fake me kidnapped Peach! So your power and that of the Dark Star have combined. Dark Bowser, it's almost too terrifying to bear. Talk about a strong enemy, I don't want to tell them, but... Hmm. Hey, you guys? Mario? Luigi? Oh, yeah! Okay, I have bad news. The Dark Star has copied Bowser. It's unfortunate, but there's only one thing we can do about it. We must join with Bowser for an epic battle with Dark Bowser. Are you guys all good? We feel you have anything left undone. Finish it now. Being prepared for this fight is your highest priority. So is this really the final <laughs> battle, then? Okay, it's time to teach that fake me a painful lesson. It's time you learn what real power is. So I guess, yeah, I need to change the controls, too. That's what I need to do, since I had to change it, like, for that minigame there. Um, but, but yeah, remember those figures with big heads, Sam? Small body and black eyes, maybe? I'm not sure. Hello, Cam. Hope things are going well today. All right, left, right, uh, yeah, up, down, and then the directional pad is left, right, up, down. 
Okay, there we go. So, what the heck were the things I just got there? Also, I need to restore some of Bowser's BP ever since I put on that item that, like, brought his BP up. There we go. Now, I need to check what this new thing here is. Tudor Fangs allows the wearer to take two actions in a single turn? What? There's gotta be a catch to that, right? That sounds broken. So that the boss fight, so that the final boss fight is more entertaining. Let's not put it on, because that actually sounds kind of broken. Wow, I can't believe I forgot to put on like better, better shells earlier. Whoops, that could have been a big buff, couldn't it have been? Oh, look at that BP I have with the divine shell now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> to the last boss with no gear. How about no? <laughs> How about we don't do that? Sounds terrible. Is there like a save point down here? Not a save point, but like a... Uh, you stay away from me. Point to heal? Fine, I'll just use my cheeses, I guess. But yeah, stuff like those. Check DM already. Stuff like... Oh, those! Those are actually pretty cute! Those are actually pretty cute figures there. I wish I had like more shelf space. Something I've actually thought about for this room. Like I don't have a whole lot of shelf space. I have like the shelves back there. That's like all the games that I own. And I still actually haven't cleaned up after the 24 hour stream. So all the games we did during the 24 hour stream are kind of all over the floor there. Along with the Wiimote rifle and Guitar Hero controller. Because I still haven't had a chance to clean it up after that event. But anyway. Uh, I basically just have like that shelf over there to put things up which isn't a whole lot of shelf space, like it's pretty full as is. So what I've actually thought about doing is putting up like floating shelves, like the kind of shelves that you attach to the wall and have like no like supports under them. Like they're just like directly onto the wall like that. So it looks like they're kind of floating out like that and just putting stuff like on those, like maybe putting like some floating shelves like above like these posters or something like that. And then being able to put up more stuff like more amiibos and stuff like that. Maybe one day, maybe one day, maybe one day I could put some above like this TV or something like that that I read chat off of like like my setup here I've thought about potentially putting some like above the TV there something like that like like up there and then I could have like figures like above the TV or something like that that internet cable up there might get a little bit in the way but but yeah so this TV that I use for like recent events and chat over there to read I could I could totally put like floating shelves above that that'd be really cool something I've definitely thought about but like I've never actually gone out and tried to do yeah they make hundreds and hundreds you're roughly 150 jeez and an ongoing collector of many different franchises how do you have enough space for that many then what the heck also is there a do I see a place that I can save here also I never got the attack pieces for Peach's Castle on Mario and Luigi there are three Pokemon Funko Pops which Pokemon I wonder. Yeah, I don't know. There will probably be a save point past here. And yeah, so I guess I'm going into the final boss without the strongest bro attack. Because I never actually got them from Peach's Castle. I could always just get them here quickly, but like, but like, whatever. Who needs them? Who needs the freaking superstar thing? I have sort of Charmander and Pikachu. It's a weird mix. Pikachu makes sense, but that's a weird mix. If none but want them. Speaking of Pokemon stuff, we should play an actual Pokemon game one of these days. Alright, what's in here? Ah, now here's the thing. I should play a Pokemon game one of these days. There are some pretty good ones out there. You have a big room. Yeah, if I wasn't, like, streaming, I could do, like, so much more with this room as well. Well, I can do enough as is. Like, in my actual room, there's not a whole lot. This is basically, like, where I live, pretty much. Like, my actual room is just, like, here. So it's like actual room and bed over there pretty much and then like washroom and stuff like that So it's all connected like that, but I have like no space for anything over there I guess I have some shelves and stuff like that But like where I but I like spend like almost no time in there unless I'm like sleeping I spend like all my time in this office that's connected to it. Like I love this office Also, I need to I meant to wait. I don't I don't have to restore I'm fully restored already because I just did the thing again. Dang it. But yeah, and even bigger has room in your new house, so you're getting more, a lot more, jeez. It's so nice to have so much space to work with. Like me in this space, I love this room so much. I love being able to have freaking four screens in front of me, one of them being a TV that I could play. 
games with with friends on a freaking couch at the can i aim the camera there at a on a freaking couch at the back of the room or like on a beanbag chair next to it i freaking love my office it's uh, having like space to play around with is like the best thing ever i love doing that and when i saw this space that was like unused for like anything productive it was just like a misc kind of storage room stuff like that or like some crates of like older stuff were put i was like this room has so much potential to be so cool and i made it into this and i was like this is literally my favorite room that i've like ever seen so i spend like all my time in here <laughs> you know speaking of i was spending a lot of time in here earlier working on like finalizing the 24 hour stream stuff uploading that all since that's all supposed to be today i have the final three parts of the 24 hour stream uploading right now i can check the progress on that What's it like? One of three is uploaded, and it's working on the other two right now, apparently. And then, once those are done, then all the 24-hour stream will be all uploaded. Which was a lot of work today, because I had to- Like, I had the parts cut out already, but I had to, like, redo a bunch of thumbnails, and, like, do a whole bunch of other stuff when it came to, like, actually getting it uploaded, and... Ugh. Uploading 27 parts in one day, and having to do some editing on some. Not fun. Alright, so do we just go up here then? Wait, it doesn't show me on the map where I'm supposed to be going. Ah, up there then, I'm pretty sure. So I guess we're approaching the final boss then. If I remember correctly, there's one more boss before the final boss. And I guess it'll be in this room then. But yeah. Ah, uh, yes, it is what I think it is, isn't it? Look, he has a DS that he uses. He has a freaking Nintendo DS. Isn't that great? He's surveying around to find the Dark Star to steal the rest of its power with his Nintendo DS there. I have collections of Kingdom Hearts, Scooby-Doo to come. Oh my goodness, this is such a long list there. Oh my goodness. It's all your tournament prize money gets invested into. Jeez. 